Welcome back. Welcome back. Welcome back, everyone. Welcome back, Canada. It's Large Ball Day. I'm your digital host this week, and I'm here with the lovely Kirsten and Michael. <laughs> <laughs> no, I love you, brother. Um, they just skated. Uh, they had their short program performance here at Nationals. Um, how did you? How, how did you feel? For the most part, it was good. Uh, the crowd was really great. The energy was good. Uh, we saw Trent and Evelyn lay down an amazing performance before us. Uh, I made a little bit of an oopsie, which is a bummer and a little bit uncharacteristic for me. So I was a little bit upset about that. But for the most part, I think our elements were successful yeah. today. Yeah. I think overall, we're headed uh, in the right direction uh, for the second half of the season here. We're uh, slowly creeping up to have that uh, perfect uh, short program, have a nice uh, special moment. Hopefully, it's going to come just in time here. Uh, for the end of the season, that's the plan. <laughs> Hint. Um, yes, you know, it's uh, worlds are coming up. They're in Canada. Um, I'm sure you know that adds some excitement uh, to the whole thing. You guys are establishing yourselves as you know the top Canadian team, and you know what is going to be the plan because you guys made the final this year, which is absolutely incredible. Um, so already, you know, you had a, a great international season. What's going to be the plan? I guess we should talk about the plan for tomorrow first before we talk about the plan for. What's going to be the plan tomorrow to, to bring it back together and to get the performance that you that you guys want? Uh, yeah, for sure. I think we're we're hoping to do what we do every day. We've been training some really great long programs and practice at home, and it's important for us to take it one element at a time. But it's becoming increasingly important to create a moment and not just tick all the boxes. And this free program really does that for us. We hope that it will do that for the audience and for the judges and for you as well. So I think that's a, a big goal. But sometimes it's tricky to stay in the moment and not get too ahead of ourselves in order to create that. Oh, I... the, uh, the free program is definitely very special to uh, both of us. So we're hoping that uh, that's going to translate out onto the ice and into the audience uh, tomorrow and really, uh, really set out yeah. uh, something special tomorrow. Well, I'm inserting myself in here because it's special for me too. It's, uh, it's, a, it's an incredible program. I think you guys carry it so well. Um, the crowd undoubtedly is going to be carried with you guys uh, you guys do a really good job at that um, I want to know uh, you guys have changed environments uh, you guys are in Toronto now with um, a completely new environment new people that you train with um, has that been different has that helped you because you know sometimes training areas can be more difficult easier how's how's the transition been in terms of environment for you guys we couldn't be happier uh, it was a hard choice for us to leave Montreal and not a decision that we took like lightly we spent a lot of time trying to figure out what we were gonna do and yeah. Um, we were hesitant at first, but we jumped in um, both feet, yeah. and we are so happy to say that it's been better than we could have even imagined. Bruno has done an amazing job at creating a, a really great environment to train in and, and to live in, and I think it's a testament to Bruno that how, how good of a person and a coach that he is, that he can surround himself with such, amaz such an amazing team yeah. that has really helped us to thrive this year and to improve. We're so happy. Yeah. Um, I wish that we would have found this sooner. Then, yeah. Right, right. And yes, we definitely. Uh, we also have a couple uh, new coaches that were uh, not unexpected, but are playing a, a definite bigger role than we would have anticipated. And it is uh, absolutely phenomenal. And uh, Brian Shales and Allison Perkis, they're definitely uh, stepped up and brought something special to the team. And they're uh, they're going to help us make that step forward and do some magic out there. That's amazing, man. I'm so excited to see you guys. I'm I'm happy about the way you guys are talking. Uh, it's very inspiring and uh, motivating for everyone. So before we talk about Worlds, we're going to let tomorrow go. We're going to enjoy the day, um, and then we'll get back on this topic of conversation later. So that sounds good? Yeah, yeah. So everyone, thank you guys for watching. Thank you for tuning in. Uh, come back. We're going to have more interviews uh, with the senior men later. So Not as cool take as care. Us, but close. The coolest. <laughs> this is the trio. This is the trio. Yeah. This is the trio. This is what we do. <laughs> take care.